In this video, we're going to have a look at NM Ghost Hunter. Now, this guy's been around for quite a while, over 10 years. And when he was about the first time, he got a lot of flack. Like some in the present day. Now, I'm just going to show you some clips here that are on his channel. Go over and check him out. This is all office-based. There's that many I've had to allocate to a video per room so you're going to see a few more of these come in your direction but i want to find out what you think now as i've been chatting something's been moving on this did you see it this guy's just randomly working at his computer and things are just weirdly moving about around him now any paranormal investigator worth their salt will be looking at this with a very skeptical eye our job is to debunk everything so let's see what you think of all this see there's even something moving beside him Now this guy has got that much on his channel. He's set up cameras everywhere. As you can see on this one, he's trying to record it and it just stops, typical. Can you see how he's doing this, if it's fake? I'm gonna test the theory as well. When you get so much evidence, like this, are we automatically going to assume it's not real? Have our minds become conditioned that we're going to assume it's just fake because it's on the internet? just tables shaking and, and this guy has set up cameras there's mirrors in these rooms I'm a little bit skeptical with that one because he kind of did a 360 why I don't know Now something appears on the mirror here. Did you see it? This is a mirror. You can see these handprints that suddenly appear. Yes, we know everything can be doctored, can be done in editing. Everything you're witnessing can is probably very doable in faking. We can do all this. We all know this. But I am not going to dismiss it as all fake at this stage. See this guy recorded all this over 10 years ago and he got that much flack. He just stopped recording. so much of this some of it because say there's loads of videos I've had to speed up because there's so much that goes on and it would have been an hour long this video but go and check him out until I actually witness Fishing lines, reflections and mirrors that are captured. I would love for somebody to come along and say, there it is. No point, don't just come on and say oh, it's all fake. Give me evidence. I want timestamps. And I'll go back over it. I'm curious to see how he's doing this if it is fake. But if it's not,
See, he's got two cameras set up there. He's tried his best to cover different angles. Now, is that... If he's faking it, is he trying to give us a, a false sense of, the look how hard I'm trying? I'm just going to see if we can capture this on camera this time. Or is it genuine? Oh, there it goes. It's moving. No strings or anything attached to it. Could be a magnet underneath. Because say everything we see, we can debunk. We know that. We're fully aware of that. We've all got no intelligence enough to know that everything can be, whatsoever. you know, pulled apart. And look, I'll show you how it can be done. We know that. We're not stupid. Does that mean it's all fake? over to his channel Nothing. check his videos out you'll see time and time again he's under desks he's behind see, desks he's looking for the cameras rolling. giving the viewer the opportunity yeah, there to it goes. It's moving. see that there's nothing set up this guy does after a bit of research have a photography sign so his main job is photography i think does that mean that he's faking it let's not make those assumptions that's oh, just being ignorant Christ. i suppose we'll never really know because we're not there and that is the only true way you can establish if something is absolutely genuine you filmed it yourself you were there you witnessed it not going to stop us looking at stuff like this with an open mind because say any paranormal investigator you've got to try and debunk everything that's your job this one was like 2 a.m in the morning just a random yoga ball again i will i have sped this up because there's so much of it I wanted you guys to see it. I wanted you to witness all the evidence. I have tried to make contact with this guy with no luck, unfortunately. Again, there's going to be skeptics out there who are going to see that as a sign of guilt. Sped this up and cut this up. This is so much of it. Look, there it goes. In the sky. He even comes across as being quite blasé and relaxed about it all. If that happened in my house, I'd be like, oh my God, I'd be freaking, wouldn't most. But this is happening all the time to you. Would you? Would you become complacent? See, he's looking at it quite analytically. Correct me if I'm wrong. Again, this one's sped up. Let me know in the comments what you think, guys. I'm going to be doing videos of this guy per room because he's got that many videos and there's some corkers coming up. So let me know in the comments. Don't forget to go and subscribe if you like this kind of stuff. Speak to you later. Bye.